by Carrie from the Writing Center. In this quick video, I will be going over how to create an APA reference entry for a web page that has a listed author. So again, in APA, different source types have different citation formats. So we're looking for a few key pieces of information anytime we're using a web page. Um, we're going to be looking for, again, if this web page has an author, we're going to be looking for the author's last name and first initial. Uh, we're going to be looking for the date, again, primarily the year. We're going to be looking for the title of the web page that we're on. And remember that APA has those unusual rules for capitalization of titles of books and articles and web pages called sentence case. And it means that most of the words will probably be lowercase. We would only capitalize words that would be capitalized in a sentence. So the first word of the title, first word of the subtitle, if there is one, and proper nouns, everything else will be lowercase. And then we're going to be looking for the container. And the container on a web page is usually the title of the overall website itself, not the specific page that you're on. So that's what we're looking for for the container. And then lastly, we're just going to copy and paste the URL and add that to the end of our reference entry. So here is an example source of a website that has an author. And so I'm going to show you how to go through and find that information. So again, first we're looking for the author. And if you kind of look around when you're on a website, you really have to look at the entire page. Sometimes you have to look up at the top, on the side, at the bottom. This one does have an author. And then we're gonna be looking for the date. And again, primarily APA is concerned with the year. Then we're gonna look for the title of the page itself. Um, and this is gonna be put in italics and it's gonna follow that sentence case rule. And this page has a pretty simple title. And then we're gonna look for that container. So the host website, and that is also fairly easy to find. And this is usually um, part both the title and the page itself are usually part of the URL. And then of course, the last thing we're looking for is that URL in the upper left corner. So our reference entry you can see is on the page here. We have the author's last name, comma, first initial. We have our date. We have the title of the source in italics. And then we've got the title of the overall website and followed by our URL. So this is how you would create an APA reference entry for a web page that has an author.